I'm gonna play the next episode. In the previous episodes of Life is Strange. Whoa! We call film Little Pieces of Time. Because Max wants everybody to see I'm so sick is. of people trying to control me! Don't ever touch me again, freak! It totally makes sense. You hella saved my life. I think it's awesome you set a tongue record on video. <laughs> We're going to be sorry someday. And there she is. How are you doing, Max? Hi, Joyce. I am so sorry about William. I have great memories of him. That was his gift to us. Wonderful memories. Let's talk about your superpower. Hey, it's Thelma and Louise. You're my business now. That's and I... Rachel's bracelet. Why the fuck are you wearing her bracelet? You want me to cut you, bitch? Please, step back. You're kidding. Put that down. Please, get me out of here! Nobody cares about me. Nobody. What are you doing here, Max? Now, I know today was difficult for everybody. Miss Caulfield, why exactly were you on the route with Kate Marsh? Please, tell us everything. What the hell is this? Max, there was no eclipse scheduled today. I believe you, Warren. I'll believe anything this week. Yeah, that eclipse is really strange. Choose wisely. Gotta be careful what I choose. Wonder what's gonna happen with Kate and Nathan. Yeah, there was another strange weather ph uh, phenomenon, an eclipse, that wasn't scheduled. And I think you're not supposed to stare at eclipses, but they were staring at it. I don't know. I don't exactly know how it works. It seems like we're breaking into something. Based on the preview from the last episode, we're breaking in somewhere and... We found something that we shouldn't have found. Ooh, cat. Oh, it's the bunny. I guess I'm taking care of it. Kate! For Kate. Oh, God. Get that ass in gear now. I knew Chloe would be all over this. So I better get moving. One minute into the episode, cringe. Bunny. Ooh, feed the bunny. Are you a hungry bunny? Here, not on this. Do I have to water the plant again? Oh, I don't have to, okay. Did I post that photo yet? Glad the media doesn't waste a second exploiting Kate. Now she has another video of herself all over the web. Uh, and even I'm in this one. Oh, at least the news didn't mention my name. Yet. Hmm. Besides Rachel, it's been a while since anybody vanished from Arcadia Bay. I shouldn't sound so disappointed. I sure hope these people treat her better when she comes back to school. If she does. Victoria said something? Either I delete my page or I block everybody. Nowhere to hide these days. Everybody will be talking about Kate now. Blackwell might as well shut down for the next month. I don't know if you can drown the plant because it didn't let me water the plant. 
last episode twice. It's amazing how happy Kate looks here compared to today. She was basically happy. pushed up to that roof. And I will use my power to find out why. This has to end. Yeah, I'm gonna find out what Nathan's up to. Let's not leave Chloe waiting. Ooh, spooky. Okay, this is scary dark. Let there be... This is Alan Wake now. Whose writing is whose? Which one's Victoria? Is it the one that's apologizing? She looked pretty messed up, but I wonder if it was because of Nathan. Hey, Max? Come oh here. shit. Hey, Dana. How are you doing? Better than Kate. I just can't believe she would even attempt suicide. Blame Victoria. Probably could blame her. I knew she was depressed, but I had no idea how bad. Must be serious to throw yourself off the roof. Kate was serious, but it's not all about that video. So what exactly are you saying, Max? You think this has something to do with Nathan being expelled? It's complicated. I don't want to drag you into this, okay? Not yet, anyway. I'm getting scared now. But people here are still sneaking out tonight. What? Like, who? Victoria bounced out of here earlier, and now you, Sherlock? Not me. I need a break from today. Get some sleep too, Dana. I'll see you later. What is that? More dialogue? Hey, Dana. Better than. Oh. Oh, I don't have to I rewind. It didn't show the rewind must be uh, icon. So, you think? Okay, it's okay, complicated. I see, I see. Right, let's, I'm getting. Let's... What? Victoria. Not me. I am wiped out, Max. We'll talk later. Wait, what? Which. Whose option got opened up? It said that's the icon for like extra dialogue. Yes, the Vortex Club does indeed suck. Oh, Victoria isn't here. Maybe I'll just wait and bide my time. Going through her shit. Is this Victoria's? Oh no, Victoria's over there. Right, right, right. It's over here. Wherever you go, there I am. The okay, Blackwell is praying for you. Who wrote the the brown one? Who apologized? I better go meet up with Chloe. This is Brooks' room. Why is this an option? Oh shit, I can actually enter. Can I mess up her stuff Since again? Since I've crossed the line from Snoop to Detective, I might as well search for clues about what really happened to Kate at the uh... Vortex Club party. Ooh, cookies. cookies! Victoria stole my cookies! Oh, those are mine! Now I can't take them back because she'll know I did it. <sighs> Victoria's a cookie monster. Can't take my cookies back. These socks cost more than my wardrobe. Ooh, kitty. Lion. I'll title this one Portrait de la Assholes. Is that Nathan in the middle? He looks so stupid. Whoa, there's Kate. Totally high. She looks confused. Not like she's partying. 
Is that evidence? Where else can I find evidence? Here they are getting loaded with Satan. What's that? Some kind of figure. Well, well. Victoria and Taylor actually show remorse. I'm avoiding some lame ass science work. How could anyone do fucking homework after somebody almost jumps off a roof? I can't believe we all saw it live. It was like watching a reality show and I've never seen the campus so quiet, like everyone's hiding or afraid. Yes, I feel like total shit for everything I said about Kate and that stupid video. Let's get some peeps to meet up later. This girl needs a serious curfew cocktail. We'll drink to Kate. So she's not a total asshole. So I guess it's just Nathan. It's though. like a thread for sociopaths. Oh shit. Max Crackfield? Lame. Party on, dudes. When did this take place? That Tweemo bitch Max Cockfield got me fucking suspended. Can you believe it? My dad owns the fucking dorm where she plays with her selfies. My parents have lost their shit and are threatening me with a fucking job in my dad's office. How dumb is he to have me repping him? Max Crackfield. God, this is so cringy. And Blackwell need to go fucking down. Oh, shit. Blow up the school. And the end of the world party is fucking on. You in? What the fuck are you kidding me? That is bullshit. No way can Blackwell suspend you. I knew that Max was trouble the first time I saw her ass kissing Mr. Jefferson with that retro cam camera. Notice that everyone she hangs around gets in trouble. And yes, the Vortex Club will be bringing the end of the world to Blackwell no matter what. I'll SMS you. Oh, who says I'll SMS you in the 21st century? This is like a... 90s thing. I'll SMS you later so we can plot in person. SMS is like a 90s thing. That's a lot of bank just to clean paint from a sweater. Oh my god. She deserved it. Victoria's secret. She's a geek. Oh, cool. Yeah, I think Nathan is the one to blame for all this. Because he seems like actually messed up in the head or something. A unique point of view is right. Thanks to Courtney Wagner ghostwriting this paper. Well, research essay with a unique point of view. Yeah. But nobody says SMS. They always say text. <sighs> Nothing to see here. I guess I shouldn't be so bummed. Not so that Victoria no couldn't hide her shit. Man, I'm getting paranoid. Oh, show us that sound. SMS is old technology. Like the old square cell phones with like all the numbers on them. So Chloe is waiting for me in front of the main hall. Yeah, the door's closed this time. What's the point of this? There's so many places to sit. I feel so giddy, even after Kate almost jumped. Maybe it's the leftover adrenaline. But I feel kind of invincible now. Where's the kitty? I keep hearing the kitty. You like the old cell phones? Even the block ones? Oh, that's not a kitty, is it? It's like some kind of bird. Principal yeah, Wells, oh, are shit. you serious? He here? I'm toast if he sees me. Nobody can expel me. 
Miss Caulfield, you have to be stealthier than that. You're not supposed to be outside your dormitory at this hour. You know that. I, I'm sorry, Principal Wells. I'm still tense after I thought Kate was going to jump today. I just needed some air and space to walk. No, no explanations. Seeing Kate come up on that roof, then seeing her come down with you. You saved her ass. <sighs> Maybe saved Blackwell. Now don't get cocky. Going back inside. You earned good dreams. Is he drunk? Great. So how do I get past him to meet Chloe? Oh shit, more texts. Just had to remind you again how fucking awesome you were today with Kate on the roof. I'll make you a superhero suit on the lab's 3D printer, cool? And he totally earned dinner on me, along with our escape to Planet O Apes. Call me. Thanks, Warren. I need to rest my cape tonight. Nathan got suspended too, so it was a good day. Call you later, okay? Uh... Hey, whore. Feminazis will be exterminated. What? Who the hell says that? Watch out. This is so stupid. Who the hell says that shit? Uh, da, 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 da. Let's see. Max, please call us as soon as you can. We're proud. We're so proud of you for saving this girl. And we want you to know how you are. We want to know how you are. So please, please get in touch. We love you. Sorry, Mom. I'll call you back in a few minutes. Swear. Thanks for letting me gush over our Blackwell hero. I miss her voice. Uh, we're very proud. So milk this moment. Let us know if you want to come up for a quick getaway. Okay. We love you, Maxine. Can I sneak by him if I do this? Because he was looking at the door for a second. Maybe I can sneak by him with this. Not yet, anyway. Oh shit, I'm going way back. Max the Ninja strikes again. Ha. Booyah! Oh my god. Get it? A jump scare. Boo, yeah. Like I'm a scary punk ghost. Ha 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 ha. Like a scary punk asshole. Hey, Chloe, I didn't exactly have the greatest day trying to keep my friend from jumping off the roof. I don't think I need you to prank me tonight, okay? Sorry, but you absolutely balls to the walls did save your friend. <sighs> Kate saved herself. I couldn't even use my power. My head felt like it was being crushed. And then I had no clue what to say to her on that roof. Don't be so modest, Rockstar. Kate is alive because of you. You obviously said the right thing, and your badass power is gonna save us all. We just need to connect the plays. And find out who almost killed Kate. We have to stop this from happening it's to anybody Nathan. else. Oh yeah, and somehow stop that tornado from wiping out Arcadia Bay, right? Didn't you say that it was all about chaos theory? I don't see any control over this chaos. Oh, right. Except for your ability to... Oh, yeah. Manipulate time and space? No biggie. Chloe, I just feel weird about some of my decisions. Especially after I just got Nathan expelled. Dude, do not even torture yourself like that. Let's focus on looking for clues, okay? We need to find out more about who Rachel was involved with around here. She was able to blend in with everybody. Even with people I hated. And even though I don't know her, it feels like Rachel is guiding us to the truth. Fuck the truth. I just want to find my friend right now. It scares me to think where she could be. Do you think she's... Dead? I'm sorry. 
I hate even saying that, Chloe. Not as much as I hate thinking it. Max, we have to find Rachel soon. We have to. I promise you we will. Like you said, it's time to start the search for clues. Now tell me what's your secret. Drum roll, please. I present the spare keys to Blackwell. Thank you, Step Prick. You are such a boss, Chloe. I just don't want you to get into any more trouble. Look at all the trouble dropping in Arcadia Bay. At this point, who gives a fuck anymore? We're in it to win it, Max. Lead the way. I'm so glad you're my partner in crime. As long as you're my partner in time. Insert groan here. Oh! Yep, groaning, cringe. So... Thank you again so much for helping me put together a portfolio. Hopefully the rest of the class will follow your lead. I'm sorry I was distracted. As you know, it's not been a good day for Blackwell. I know this has been an awful day and you can talk to me anytime, Mr. Jefferson. Thank you, Victoria. I'm glad it had a relatively happy ending. I don't know what I would have done if Katie jumped. Katie? I had no idea you two were that close. Did she? Well, how does this affect the Everyday Heroes contest? Oh, she's sucking it up. doesn't. The contest is still a go, and I still have to pick the winner to best represent Blackwell. I've got all the photos, except one from Max. I'll give you a one-word sneak preview of Max's photo. Selfie. Listen, you've seen my entry. You know it's better than that. Wouldn't that be so cool to hang out together in San Francisco, Mark? Stick to Mr. Jefferson, Victoria, please. And, uh, I haven't picked a winner yet. You already love my work, so it's not like you're playing favorites. Just imagine if you picked my photo, though. We would have to spend a lot of time together. That could be fun, don't you think? I'm going to think that you didn't say any of that. You might as well choose me. Otherwise, I might have to tell people you offered to choose my photo for favors or something. As a favor to your future, I'll also ignore that undisguised threat. This conversation is officially over, Miss Chase. I suggest you go back to your dorm now. Wait! I only... Are you fucking kidding me? Wow. So I guess she so likes the teacher, or she's just sucking up, or both? Who knows? Just when I think Victoria can't get any more evil. Shit is about to get real at Blackwell. Let's go find out. Oh, that's what it is, to the school. You know it. So what are we doing in here, anyway? Dude, I don't know about this. We're both already in so much trouble. Not to mention the weed you brought into my room. Joking. I'm serious. We're not kids anymore. Aren't there cameras like here? And Wait, there are cameras! What are we doing? We're gonna be breaking. We can't charge us for just entering. I'm serious. We could go to jail. Not if I'm related to the head of Blackwell security. Step shit will not want me in the hands of the local police. So we better find out what's in the principal's office first. You can rewind if we get caught, right? You have mad powers, Max. But my powers didn't save Kate. Maybe I did on my own. Come on, one more door and our work here is done. I signed the petition, but they said that it didn't help or something. Somebody said that. I think the, the stepdad said that. That's it. What the fuck? The security officer should have the key to the principal's office. He's hiding shit, like everybody here. Well, now we definitely have to get this door open. Believe it or not, God. I know a little about lockpicking, thanks to Frank. I might as well test out my thief skill. Go for it. We're already in this deep. Well, you could look for the key, just in case. Why, yes, I could. Here are the keys. None for the principal's office. 
We have to look for a key that's not labeled. Okay. Crap. He wouldn't just leave his key around, though. Boring. Dead end. Nothing here. No key for thee. We have to find another way in. Guess I didn't spend enough time with Frank. But I'll use my DIY lockpick tools while you come up with a better plan. My plan has a name. Hey, Warren, you busy? Just bubble hearth, you'll be okay. Listen, I need your physics expertise stat. Without naming names, if somebody had access to the art and science labs and wanted to construct a device that would, say, open a locked door, would you maybe kind of know how? Huh? No, I'm just asking for fun. Thanks, science guy. Uh, no, 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 stay. We need you as backup. Just send the text instructions now. Yes, I'm still all in to go ape with you at the drive-in. Thanks for the hope. This sucks ass. Goddamn door. Try not to wake up everybody at Blackwell. Sorry, Max. I got nothing. What about your plan? Sugar soda can I'm gonna go tape. put it together. Sodium can you stay it? here and not get caught? I might get on the other side of that door before you, Lupin. The race is on. See you soon. Nice drawing. Amazing drawing. All right. Sugar, soda can, duct tape, sodium chlorate. Where do I find all these things? I should probably go to the science lab first. Warren is such a classic nerd. Let's see if I can find those items. Oh, soda can. Release the crack can. Ah! Why do you have to do this every time? It's all mine anyway. Only three more uh. items to go. Gross. I hate that formalin smell. An A minus? All right, all right. So Dr. Max did help Warren this morning. Whoa, whoa, whoa. change grade? You deserve way more than this for taking on Nathan, but every little grade counts. Wait, what did I change it to? Yes, I like this plus better than that minus. Thanks for being there for me, Warren. Uh, should I do that? I don't think I should do that. I don't think we should be leaving evidence of us being here at all. Ooh, sugar. You're halfway home, Max. Yes, I blew up. So, sodium chlorate is a weed killer. You'd think Warren would have told me that factoid. Wow, it's graffiti everywhere. Yeah, it's too obvious. Oh, weed killer. Here's the sodium chlorate box. Cigarette? You know you're clumsy, Max. Is it gonna spill? Don't waste your rewind power. Use the damn chair. <sighs> she can't grab anything without help. 
from boost. Any kind of boost. Okay, what else do I need? What else do I need? Duct tape, okay. Duct tape should be in here too, right? Or maybe it's in another room. Let me look around. I'm just looking for text whenever it pops up. Because usually it pops up when you walk near something. Duct tape is like heavy duty, so it probably wouldn't be just lying around somewhere. Why are the doors unlocked? This is like a scene in a horror film. Yeah, it is. Oh, Kate. Even when you were sad, you tried to see the good in the world. Victoria. That is pretty fucking sweet. How can I hate somebody that shoots like that? Wait, what? It's a guy. Drawing on a piece of paper or something. Wow, amazing. Entry. Daniel's a better illustrator than photographer. <laughs> Said Max, the art critic. Cigarette. Victoria's cigarettes? I'm sure Mr. Jefferson is impressed. Why is there duct tape here? The tape is mine. Now it's time to show Chloe that Max is the bomb. Take it easy on the door, Chloe. Let's try this instead. Boom! Literally. I made that instantly. Yes! Time to blow shit up! If you'll light the candle. This is so cool! Get ready to haul ass. Oh shit. This can't be good. Holy shit, that was loud. So fucking cool! Oh, we are toast! Uh -oh. Here comes the whole Arcadia Bay Fire and Police Department. Uh, so what should we do? Oh, I can go inside and rewind, right? That was so stupid. But I guess because we have these powers, it all works out. Open, she can't cheat with her rewind. Too late. Oh, this is bullshit. Fuck you, door. Welcome to my domain. You are magic. I have no clue how the hell you got in there, but you did it, sister. The company I keep. Now, let's find what we want and beat it. My powers only go so far. Man, I can see why the principal locks this room up. Fancy faux art crap. He must want everybody to know he has money, but no taste. How can you trust somebody who has a fucking bronze bird in his office? I'm glad I was expelled. Yes, if only the principal had a Monet or Picasso, you'd still be at Blackwell. Eat me. I'm gonna pilfer the papers on this ugly-ass desk. Maybe there's some evidence of him taking bribes. Okay, sure. It's ugly, but damn, is it a cozy chair. There's probably cameras in here, too. Or maybe there this isn't. This is your chance to truly get all deductive and shit, Sherlock. Find us some clues about Rachel, or Kate, or Nathan. Anybody. I'm on the case. 
probably hiding something. This pretty much sums up Kate. Shy and sweet. And in the wrong place. Can't see the rest. Only two more files. Yeah, incredible art. Files to go. Two more files. Oh, I have to find Rachel's files. And uh, Nathan's I files. certainly can't use this. It looks like an oil painting spill. Awful. Look at this pile. So, Nathan Prescott's dad is a bully, too. Shocker. What does that say? In light of the recent outrageous allegations against my son and his suspension, I feel that my large contributions to Blackwell Academy should also be suspended. Wow. Of course, the situation can be rectified once Nathan is reinstated at Blackwell with a written apology. Ah. Along with that, I understand the tragic event involving Miss Marsh gives you pause, but I would suggest that Canceling Thursday's party is not conductive to the can-do spirit of Blackwell Academy. I expect you to reconsider and come to the same obvious conclusion. Maybe Nathan's dad is the evil guy. And Nathan's like carrying out his wishes. Because why would he care about the party that Nathan's running, right? And it seems like at the party, that's where all this shit happens. With Kate and uh, Rachel as well. Because Rachel was last seen at a party. Tumbleweeds. Weird. This asshole has a spotless record. Like I'm not going to read my own personal file. 2.8 GPA. This file is going to be so spotless, I'll projectile vomit. I have to make sure Warren doesn't have a criminal background. Warren is a 4.0. Smart guy. Let's nab this last file, Sherlock. Always wanted to say nab. Or, you know, you could not say that. Rachel doesn't seem so troubled based on all this. But there's not much here about the police investigation. Rachel is super smart, too. Hmm. Man, I don't blame the principal for expelling Chloe. 1.7. Bad, Chloe. Oh my god. I think we found everything in here. I should go join Chloe now. Ooh, whiskey bottle. I'd drink too if I was the principal of Blackwell. Yeah, because he'd be paid off by the Prescotts. Should I turn off the light? Did I actually take the file or just read it? Probably is the entire family and whoever Max, is uh, running things. you better things. come check out these files. Nathan accuses Rachel of bringing drugs on campus? And my step troll went along because he thinks Rachel was a bad influence on me. Assholes. If David is teaming up with Nathan Prescott, that's a bad sign. Oh shit, that's Nathan really bad. Nathan Prescott the third. Ooh, he's so money. And you know the Prescotts dropped major bank to bury Nathan's real file. Look, it reads like a rap sheet. Bad grades, teacher complaints, secret probation. But I was expelled? At least Nathan was finally suspended. Check out that note. Open it. It's just some crazy drawing. It's not a drawing. Look. Rachel in the dark room. Rachel in the dark room. Over and over. That's it. That's fucked up. What does this even mean? Nathan is truly psychotic. I know he has something to do with Rachel missing. Whoa, listen to this. David M. always asks what's going on in my head. David M. always helps me follow those he follows. <sighs> it's pretty cryptic. No, it sounds like they formed some sort of weird team, the Super Hebros. Jesus. 
David was stalking Kate, hassling me, and now we know he was all over Rachel, too. Oh, we are so going into his garage files. Plus, I'm getting a little paranoid in here. We got our info. Let's bail. But maybe we shouldn't leave without a gift. No, you are not taking the cozy chair. Max, do your powers include mind reading? Or did you just rewind because I tried to steal the chair? Shit, I'm confused. It's the powers of best friendship. I know how you roll. We should definitely get out of here. We pressed our luck enough. Hello, what have we here? Holy shit! Jackpot! Cha-ching! Wow, sir. That's a lot for the handicapped fund. Dude, there's $5,000 here. I could pay Frank back tonight. Uh... This will chill him out after you almost, you know, shot him. Are you going to make a big issue out of this? Or just rewind and take the greenbacks for yourself? I hope you do that instead of lecturing me. Okay, why would we steal the money? Yeah, the, the whole Nathan thing sounds really... Suspicious. It sounds like he kidnapped Rachel. Maybe he's- maybe uh, Rachel is still there. Wherever she is. Huh. But it's been like, what, five, six months since she disappeared? She disappeared in April. Uh, it's October now. I don't think stealing the money is a good idea. Plus, there are cameras everywhere, so they can probably... Well, I assume there are cameras everywhere. I'm not sure if they're actually online, so I think it's too risky. But Chloe does owe $3,000 to Frank. And how is she going to get God. I think I should just leave it. I don't think I should steal it. Stealing is bad. You really want to take money from the handicapped fund? Oh yeah, that too. I know you need to pay Frank Stealing back, money but... from the handicapped. I've got my power to protect you, right? There's a lot of power in that horse-choking wad of cash. But yes, Moral Max is right again. I guess. Let's get the hell out of this office morgue. I know that money would have helped Chloe and me. Hans Hawk. That is so cool that my signature actually counted. Go, Miss Grant. Oh, so it actually worked. The petition actually worked. So maybe there are no cameras here. Oh, I should take the money. You're not so tacky up close. Yeah. Yeah, I, don't, I still don't think we should take the money, though, even if there are no cameras here. That impish look scares me. Care for a midnight swim? The Blackwell pool is ours. Swimming? Oh, my God. You want to take that risk now? It's been a cray week. You didn't want oh, to take God, that money to pay week. off Frank, so if he pops a cap in my skull, at least allow me to have a little carefree fun for a few minutes. Splish Splash? You're right. We hella deserve it. This is like Splish the most Splash. cliche. Did you actually thing just say ever. hella? I think I'm a good bad influence on you. Yeah, you say a lot worse. This is like the most cliche setup for something really bad to happen. Let's go for a swim in the abandoned school. Nothing can happen here. And then something bad happens. We're in the otter's lair. Big fucking deal. I want that heated water. We still have to play it cool, okay? I still go to school here. You can own this hellhole once you figure out your rewind power. Chloe is so psyched for girls night out, so I better follow her evil plan. Don't think this is a good idea. Boys or girls? Boys. Oh, sneaking into the boys' room. Boys, of course. Figures. Perv. 
So cliche. Let me check to see if the pool's heated. So cliche. Something bad's gonna happen. Seriously, this is this is like such a typical setup for something really bad to happen. Oh, cell phone. Zach is really careless. Doesn't he know what happens when I'm around? Oh god. Is this recent? Wow. Oh my oh my god, you're right. I'm gonna find Warren's stuff. Betty developed that in Jefferson's class. But why? Why indeed. That's all he has in there. He's sick. Some poor hipster lost their vape. Oh my god, Nathan's locked in? It's okay for Nathan to be hooked on these drugs, right? Of course. It's all drugs inside his locker. This must be for training kids. No worries, it's all bad. Victoria loves the D. Nice. I think that's expected. What the hell is this? What is a feminazi? I never hear anyone say that shit. I love Warren Gay Ram. Nice. So mature. Do people actually do this kind of shit? Because I haven't seen anything this bad ever. Max Caulfield, Moral Avenger. This one is almost empty. The guys must like their pink goo. The pink goo is nasty as hell. Oh, Rachel seems to be popular. I don't think anybody has ever drowned here. I hope. Yes, we get it. Otters. Yeah, I don't think it ever gets this bad. Coffee and swimming. Good combo. Let's get this over with. Time to get killed! Max, try to find the light for the pool. I want to see the sharks. Otters don't like sharks. They bite. So do I. Hit that light! How is Max a feminist at all in this? There's like no... Oh, shark. Just when I thought it was safe to go back in the water. She doesn't really, like, do anything really. She just makes comments about everything and tries to help her friends. Oh, feminazi. Where would the lights be? Oh, maybe in that room I was in. I think that's what it was. No running. All too late. Oh, maybe here. I haven't checked this one yet. Oh, wait. I have. Oh, no. Wait, oh, wait. Is this the girl's room? Oh, this is the girl's room. Dear Kate, I don't care, God. Nice. That is, uh, pretty bad. Some of the girls here are so cruel. Some of the every, every, doesn't matter, boys or girls, so cruel. Looks like Brooke wants to go to the drive-in with Warren. Yeah, and, uh, we kind of took her place there. Where does that other sock go? Otters eat beavers. What? The wit. It burns. A bus ticket? Was she going to run away? Like Rachel Amber? 
Is that what happened? So, Victoria's secret is selfies. Go fuck your... No. Jefferson said, don't confuse art with the artist. These are cool shots. Those look like the most cozy, comfy towels in towel history. Want. All right, where are the lights? Let's get this scene over with. I want to see what happens. There has to be a control panel for the lights oh, around go. here. Here we go. Wait, she brought her swimsuit? Time to do or dive, Max. How do I dive? Do I have to change? Oh yeah, baby. Feels like a hot tub. Too bad you made me feel like the queen of assholes because I wanted that cash stash. Tell me you're not gonna stand there watching me like a zombie. Don't you dare! Come stop me, hippie! Okay, you asked for it. Cowabunga! Such a cliched scene. Why look, an otter in my water. Dun, dun, oh! dun, 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 dun. You are so obvious. And I still get freaked out by that movie, so stop. I can't even watch any of those shark shows. <laughs> I'll just rewind and harpoon you. Otter's revenge. Cheater. Yeah, you wouldn't know about that. <laughs> I wish Rachel was here. She would totally love being in here at night. Wish you guys had met each other. We will. With all this stuff going on, I'm starting to think everything is related. And I want to find out for Kate's sake. She almost died today. Your power is changing everything, Max. Especially you. I can already tell. You're not so chicken shit anymore. Thanks, girlfriend. You know what I mean. You're becoming like... This force of nature. More like luck of nature. Come on, my power failed trying to rescue Kate. Maybe I'm just stumbling back and forth in time. For what reason? You didn't stumble when you saved me, Max. Thank God. But what if I had? What if Kate didn't jump, but you would be dead? So it's time to start moving forward in time. And we're obviously connected since without me, you would have never discovered your power, right? Absolutely. You make me feel like I know what I'm doing. And you make me feel like I have a reason for still being in Arcadia Bay. I hope so. Stop being so goddamn humble. You're like the smartest, most talented person I've ever known. More than Rachel Amber? Dude, I'm not her groupie, okay? And I'm sure you have Blackwell bros all over you. Like Warren. Warren is nice. Nice. <laughs> nice? Ouch. That means friend zone. No, he's really cool. It was so sweet when he stood up to Nathan. But I haven't told him about my rewind power. No worries. Wait, I thought you did. Once you get over yourself, you're going to make the world bow. As long as you're there with me. Don't look so sad. I'm never leaving you. Now I'm getting cold in here. Because we're yapping instead of attacking each other, otter versus shark style. I uh, think I've had my pool experience for the year. Let's check. Let's call it a draw. I'm gonna freeze my ass off when I get out. I thought during the eclipse ending, I guess you weren't here for that. They were talking. It seemed like they were talking about some, like, the time.
time travel stuff, but maybe I'm wrong. Gross. I feel like we just went swimming in Chlorine Bay. You look cute with your hair soaked in chemicals. Thanks. You would know. Oh shit! Hi! Oh shit, oh shit, oh shit. Where do I hide? We have to go now. Make sure you cover the whole place. Are you shitting me? Oh shit. There's more than one, it's not just him. Dude, hide. Like when we were kids. How do we hide? Use my power, or just look for a hiding spot, or both. Where are they? Hey! Oh shit! Okay, don't go that way. Go into the stalls. Where are they? Hello? Is he gonna check the stalls? Hello? Oh Are shit. There? Oh shit, oh shit, oh shit. Better not try any Halloween pranks after today. I'm serious. I heard something over here. Who's here? I got, I got a flashlight and a stick. Why can't I go out? Is he leaving? God, can I even leave? Oh shit, he's right there! Oh my god! What do I do, what do I do? Oh shit, Chloe's there. You're so invisible. Let's bail. Okay, that went better than I expected. I thought something even worse was gonna happen. Wait! Turn around! They're coming! We have to find another way out! Oh, this is bullshit! You can't go back to your dorm now. You're a Blackwell fugitive. Crash at my place tonight. You want me to crash where the Blackwell security officer lives so I'll be safe? <laughs> okay. Into the car! Get Wait, in! if they were on the outside, they would have seen the car already. So they would have known that it was Chloe. <laughs> Later, fuckers! Max, you rock! We are so fucking awesome! <laughs> yes, we so are. Yeah, it's not very stealthy. <laughs> This is a terrible idea, still. 